Are you flying with the Philippine Airlines or Cebu Pacific either to the Philippines or from the Philippines to another country? Watch this video so that you will know the latest airport updates about their local and international flights. Travelers, welcome back to another episode of Jimmy Aris Talk TV, where I will bring to you videos about travel, travel updates, tips, guidelines. Also, I'll be bringing to you videos about lifestyle, career, business, and of course, life about working overseas. So what are you waiting for? Click that subscribe button and notification bell so that you'll get updated every time we have a new video. So for the month of July 2023 onwards, let me share to you the updates regarding their airport assignment for departure and arrival here in the Naia terminals or the Manila airports. If you will be flying with the Philippine Airlines for their domestic flight, please check your flight status as Philippine Airlines will now operate flights bound to Antique. Basco, Busanga, Calbayo, Catarman, and Shargao at the south wing side of Naia Terminal 2 starting today. That's July 17, 2023. The north wing side will serve all remaining palp domestic flights so what you have to do is simply number one simply go to the website that's www.philippineairlines.com number two check the flight status tab for any changes or any updates and number three when you input the flight number and departure date make sure you input it with the pr from the flight number or 2p for the destination are you flying domestic with the Philippine Airlines? The PAL domestic flights will use both wings of Manila Terminal 2 starting only yesterday, that's July 17, 2023. South wing side flights are as follow Antique, Basco, Busuanga, Coron, Calbayog, Catarman, and Shargao. And North wing side as of June 21, 2023, the domestic flights of the Philippine Airlines are as follow. So we have Bacolot, Butuan, Cagayan de Oro, Caticlan, Cebu, Cotabato, Davao, Dipolog, Dumaguete, General Santos, Iloilo, Calibo, Lawag, Legazpi, Manila, Ozamis, Pagadian, Puerto Princesa, Rojas, Tacloban, Tagbilaran and Zamboanga. And travelers for the international flights of the Philippine Airlines, now they operate at Naia Terminal 1. Please check your flight's assigned terminal before proceeding to the airport just in case of any changes. And there are shuttle buses between Terminal 1 and 2. It's available for passengers with connecting flight. Now, if you're flying international with the Philippine Airlines, please simply proceed to Terminal 1. OPA International Flights will now operate at Naia Terminal 1, while OPA Domestic Flights will now operate at Naia Terminal 2. For departure and arrival, if you are flying internationally with the Philippine Airlines, here are their destinations. We have Bali, Bangkok, Beijing, Brisbane, Busan, Damam, Doha, Dubai, Fukuoka, Guam, Guangzhou, Hanoi, Ho Chi Minh, Saigon, Hong Kong, Honolulu, Jakarta, Xinjiang, Kuala Lumpur, Los Angeles, Macau, Melbourne, Nagoya, New York, Osaka, Kansai, Perth, Phnom Penh, Port Moresby, Riyadh, San Francisco, Seoul, Incheon, Shanghai, Singapore, Sydney, Taipei, Tokyo, Haneda, Tokyo, Narita, Toronto, Vancouver, and Shamet. 
To all arriving international passengers, you must register at least within 72 hours before your arrival to the Philippines. And to all departing Filipino passengers, you must register at least three hours before departure. Once again, for departing Filipinos only, all foreign passport holders are not required to complete the e-travel departure. For foreign passport holders, only the e-travel arrival is what you are required to complete. Please go to the website https colon slash slash etravel.gov.ph and the registration is for free. And for those who will be flying domestically and internationally with Cebu Pacific, it will be at Naia Terminal 3. While if you'll be flying with Sebco, it will be at Naia Terminal 4. If you find this video helpful and informative, please click like and I'm inviting you to subscribe to my channel and follow me from my and click follow for my FB page and TikTok account. So with that, everyone, to all who will be flying anytime soon, have a pleasant and safe flight. And for those who go, and for those who are going for vacation, enjoy your vacation. With that, everyone, thank you for watching, and I'll see you in my next video.